welcome to my channel this is the fifth episode of our programming video if you haven't watched our previous four videos click on the above link to watch it so in today's video we're going to learn about my blocks so now let's log in scratch.org website so if you see at the last category it might say my blocks but there isn't any blocks in here because you haven't made a block so we're going to make a few blocks and explain how they work so now let's create our sprite so i have created my sprite so now let's program it with my blocks so we're not going to have any backdrops in our backdrops because this sprite is going to draw with my blocks so now let's start our first my block programming So we are also going to use pen in the extension. So I'm going to set my color to red. So we're going to draw a simple shape like square. So now let's make our my blocks. So I'm going to name mine square because I'm going to draw a square. So now I'm going to explain how a my blocks looks like. So now let's program our square block. So whatever you program in here transfers to the block over here and undoes whatever it says in here. So now let's test our programming. So now let's test it. So we can see it's working. So now we just got to make this 
the sprite draw a square over here. So now we can see that it is working. So now we just got to set the colors to red. So now let's test us again. So we can see it's working now. So this is how a mind block works or making your own block works. So whatever you do in this in this programming all goes to this this tiny little block and does whatever programming that you did in here. So that's how a mind block works. So I'm going to share this project and I named it Square. Don't forget to remix this project and also like this project. So I'm going to put this project in the link in the description. So now I'm sharing it. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you like this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.